President Thabo Mbeki. Then President Mbeki went a step further, publicly disclaiming any link between HIV and AIDS. A study by Harvard University concluded that Mbeki's AIDS policy was directly responsible for the deaths of 330,000 people. Since then, hundreds of thousands more South Africans have died of the disease. I will never be the same again, they sing, referring to those forced to live with the virus. They sing in honor of former presidents Nelson Mandela and Bill Clinton, who both championed strong government action to fight the disease. In 2006, future president Jacob Zuma confessed in court that he had sexual intercourse with an HIV-infected woman. He notoriously claimed that, in order to fend off the virus, he took a shower afterwards. Such trivialization of AIDS has angered activists and educators the world over. Almost 23 million people in sub-Saharan Africa are living with HIV. As well as physical pain, sufferers often face social ostracism, being expelled from their villages and rejected by their families. Many of the patients have tuberculosis. Some have come too late for the medication to have any effect. Seventy percent of the people in this funeral home have died of the disease. Some 2.1 million people died of AIDS worldwide in 2007. <laughs> 